Hello, my friends. It's Nancy Vastein. Look what I've been doing. I've been making these dandelions. And I'll show you how I did it. Some of you probably already have seen it. Um, but it's with a toilet paper roll. Yep. And I started cutting it. And I'm going to finish cutting it around like this. I got this inspiration from, I had her name right here, now I can't find it, it's, oh goodness, I can't find it, but I'll link her, her video down below where she shows it, anyhow, it makes these fun little dandelions and I'm going to do one with you so you can see how I did it I used um, yellow and orange paint uh, deco art paint with this one and now for this one so then we want to bend these back a little bit okay like so I can't remember who else was doing it I don't know if it was Betsy Doodle or Nina or I don't know who who else I saw doing this. And I know I saw somebody else, but I can't remember to save my soul. So anyway, um, this is just copy paper. So we're going to do these next ones in blues. And I'm going to use my... Uh, fluid acrylics my deco art fluid acrylics and we're going to start with the lightest turquoise one and I'm, I've got a little plastic here that I'm going to pour it out on oh gosh I got goobers and you don't need a lot of paint I found out you don't you hardly need any and then I'm going to spread it out into a circle. Like so. And then dip my stuff in it. Needs to be a bigger circle than that. I might need a little more paint. I found out I was wasting a lot of paint uh, by putting too much down. All right, let's see if that'll work. You just go around and get your paint on there. And then you just gently put it on there. Now it's not going to look like much the first, but you just wait. Now we're going to go to the next one, which is, I think it's going to be, this is more of a purple hue, but this one is, I don't know, some kind of blue. Yeah, spread my paint out. And 
in my little circle. Get my little toilet paper dandelion. Now, if you didn't want to make them so big, like this is pretty big around, don't cut your, your things so far down. Okay, you just want to put it on there. See that? See how that layers? I'm liking that. All right, now I gotta get rid of this. So I can um, do another one. I don't want to waste it as much as possible. I'm just going to leave it on that piece of paper and turn it over and use the other side. And wipe my little spatula off. Now I'm going to go to this, um, this blue is primary cyan, cyan, cayenne, ooh, spread it around. Get my toilet paper, dandelion. And dip it in. Can you start seeing them? Is that just cool or what? I think this is the neatest thing ever. And I dripped on my paper. Oh well. Now we're going to go to the dark one, which is cobalt blue. Come on. Now oh, I know you're in there. It dried up. Look at that. There we go. I'll get some out of there now. Mix it up a little bit. Stir it around. That one smells bad. And I'm just going to go right in there with the dark one. See that? See we layer it? How cool it looks. Now if you want to, what I was doing is I took a baby wipe on my fingers like this and I just went into the blue and just dabbed it around on the inside like this to give it a little hue on the inside and then I took my little liner brush. Where is it? Now see if I can do this. I put a little bit of water in this. Made a little runny. And then I took this and 
went like this and made a line. And it's crooked because I'm shaky. I can tell all you guys now what we found out about Wes. He uh, tested positive for hep C, hepatitis C, and he's not a happy camper. So we don't know where he got it from because he hasn't had any tattoos in his life. He hasn't, he was a, uh, a drug user back in the 70s and we don't know if it would show up now or not but yeah he was a needle user back in the 70s so it could have been from that but we have to go see a gastrologist gastrologist I can't say that word anyway he has to go see that kind of a doctor this month he needs to get another bunch of blood work done and uh, so hopefully maybe he just had a false a positive test because he tests out false positive for um, tuberculosis also but so anyway, there's our dandelions. Is that just cute or what? Here's that one, and here's this one. I just think they're just so cute. And yeah, I'm really liking it. I'm going to gather up some toilet paper rolls and I'm going to make me different different um, not cut them so long and I'm going to make different sizes with them and just think how fun that will be on a jelly plate yeah alright guys thanks for watching and uh, if you're new to my channel thank you for coming uh, thank you for all the new subscribers and if you haven't subscribed yet, please do. And also, when you subscribe, there's a little bell by the subscription uh, box. If you push that, you'll get notifications when I have new videos up. So you won't miss anything. Alrighty, thanks. Bye-bye.